So, UFC fighter Erwin Rivera stabs two of his sisters, leaves one of his sister in critical condition and the other one in stable condition based upon him hearing voices from a higher power. Like, subscribe, ID in the Discovery Channel. Yes, ID in the Discovery Channel. The links are provided below. Get that Discovery Go app as well as the ID Go app. You might want to get those two things combined to make them into one, and I'm a Discovery Influencer. That's indeed a fact. So, once again, Irwin attacked two sisters in his Florida home as they slept. He claims a higher power told him to do so, such as the attack of both sisters. It took multiple people calling 911, which led to Rivera being arrested. When authorities arrived on the scene, both sisters were covered in blood and stab wounds on the victims' backs, arms, faces, and on their hands. That's where the, the wounds, in fact, were, right? Uh, once again, one victim is said to be in critical condition and the other one is in stable condition, not stab condition, stable condition. He's to face uh, two charges of premeditated murder because what has occurred and of course doing that, the stabbing right, places as it has placed his career on hold. Yeah, that, that's like a form of schizophrenia, you know, sch schizophrenia or drug use at play. Some people, they don't know that even drug use can have you hallucinate and hear voices or hear all type of things, right, that place others in danger, right? That's how even schools, people get killed, young children even adults get killed at schools or have or out in the public right them being told by voices in the person's mind to do things schizophrenia but to drug usage that's what i was going back to and saying not everybody knows that even drug use can play a part in that uh not getting enough sleep being up for more than seven days or so you start to hallucinate right so his mental state is in question and it has been right even before what has taken place right that's to say he might need to be placed on hold a lot longer to do some investigation on his mind to prevent that sort of thing something like that could happen in the ring i'm saying you never know what's a likelihood to occur when it comes to yeah mental illness and all the rest right so we're on investigation discovery.com the id logo stands in the far left corner live now welcome to murder town now scrolling so new episodes to gain access is to provide who you're subscribed to you to in fact gain access to that unlock episodes to receive an audio visual preview is to click the play button and you would in fact receive that yeah because that's a scary thing to hear voices telling you this or telling you that because that's to say the voices are overpowering you or overruling you that that sort of thing as in people have in fact killed themselves in hearing voices that's what makes it scary it makes it even more scary too in hearing voices and it's telling you to kill the person that's family member once again recommended for you shouts out to lieutenant joe kenda as well as paula that's gotta it's gotta be scary for the person that's hearing voices id go original series maybe that's why some people mental patients as when you hear it, well they didn't tell that they were hearing voices or this or that yeah because that's got to be scary for even the person themselves hearing hearing things or hearing a voice telling them. For me, that would be scary if that was to happen to me. I probably would be turning around looking like what, right? Uh, to receive a newsletter from Investigation Discovery is a sc scroll down, type your email address in and click next and you in effect receive a newsletter from Investigation Discovery. So dear viewers, let me know what you think and feel about this video. May you enjoy your day and I in fact will enjoy mine as well. And I'm gone for more now. Now.